Question. How do you know if a guy wants to sleep with you or wants an actual relationship? Guys usually tell women what they want to hear in the beginning to get what they want. Love this question. How can you tell the difference? Okay, ladies, let's just first understand this. Every time you've heard the phrase, men love the hunt, men love the chase, do you think they're actually chasing? I want to be in a relationship. I want to be in a relationship. I want to be in a relationship. Do you think that's what we're actually chasing or hunting for? No. Biologically speaking, what do we hunt for? We hunt to get laid. We hunt to spread our seed. That's what we're hunting for. And men love compet. We love to competition. Yeah, we love that. When we get laid once. Okay. So all those guys that come on strong and everything, and you're just thinking, oh my God, he's just so perfect. Guess what? When a man comes on ridiculously strong, and he's also, and this is the caveat for you, Amanda, if it's also leaning towards a sexual nature, then chances are he's in it for the short run, for the sex run, okay? The sex run. Men who are actually high quality men, high value men, whatever you talk about, that genuinely want a spouse, a wife, someone in their life long term, they still look at I am a horny son of a bitch. I love to fuck and I want to fuck regularly. And it really sucks not having a girlfriend for the last few years. So let me just be clear about that. OK. And yes, I have done what most men I have done this in the past. I've done what I call relationship talk to convince you to have sex with me. I've done that. But it's usually I'm pushing the sex first. I say that I do the relationship talk. To, it's, it's to tee it up. But I'm immediately pushing sex. Most guys will tee up with the relationship talk. They'll push for sex. And then as soon as they've had the sex, they disappear because that's what they were chasing. How do you know a man is genuinely serious? First off, if you go out, here's the thing. Most men who are just in it for the sex barely will date you three times, will barely date you three times. So if you go out four, five, or six, most of the time I'm seeing most women, at least my clientele, they're having sex somewhere between the sixth and 10th date. Most men who are in it for the short run barely make it past the third date. Now, does that mean the relationship is going to work out? Absolutely not but you have a better chance of weeding them out by basically being a little bit, you know, there's an old saying, men are the gas, women are the brakes. Just be a little bit slow in the sex department. But if someone is coming on way strong sexually, that's usually the sign. And again, I'm a horny guy. I like to talk about sex too, but I'm also patient. I'm not pushing someone. Ultimately, the right guy waits for when you're ready. That's the bottom line. The right guy waits for when you're ready, not when he's ready, when you're ready. Is this sinking in? Is this resonating? I hope it is. Great question, Amanda. Love, love, love that. All righty. 